Am I good? Yeah. So, cool. Hit it. Uh, uh, I will play uh, Furflum, Carl, uh, tap. Alright, I'm gonna draw some pass. I will draw. Sick. That is a land. I'll play this Thriving Heath. It's gonna enter tapped. I'm gonna name green uh, as the other color and pass. I'll draw. I'll play planes and then I'll pass. I'll play mountain and I'll pass. I'm gonna play a. Is that the beginning of your turn? You got opters. Have I played against this deck of yours before? I'm gonna be a dirty, dirty piece of shit here. I'm gonna play a forest, and here's a soul ring. And then I'm gonna pay a white and the soul ring for a... This sun wing, uh, flying 2-3 creatures your opponents control enter the battlefield tapped. And then I will pass. I'll draw. Play lanes, uh, not tap 2, cast my deuter, and I'll pass. Play forest, green. Tap all three. Uh, I will play Rhythm of the Wild. Uh, creature spells can't be countered, and non uh, token creatures you still have Riot. Uh, sure. I will pass. Confluence. I'm gonna move to combat. Doctor. I'll take one. Uh, yeah, I'll take two. Oh, sure. You're. I, just for my clarity, tokens, they don't enter, they won't enter in tap. Or uh, they did. They're entering Creatures. Tap tapping, right? Um, yeah, the gnomes come and tap and tap on yeah. the adopter. Because it's like pre-combo. Because the Kanjali, yeah. All right, yeah, I'm just curious. Adopter doesn't come in. We're good to... Yeah, we're good. Get to... Yeah, we're good. Okay, cool. I'm going to play planes. Uh, and then... One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I need red. <laughs> I don't have red. I named green for this thing. Um, um, I'll pay five is we're gonna play dinosaurs. I'm gonna play the Scion of Calamity. It's a 5-5 five five with Myriad. Uh, whenever it deals combat damage to a player, destroy target artifact or enchantment that player controls. Um, yeah, and then I'll uh, go to combat and I will send this 2-3 in the air at uh, Marat. Actually, Sully. And then pass. We'll play planes. I will tap a green and a red. I will play Grover the Mighty. Tap to get a plus one. I'll tap one. I'll play my own soul. I will pass the turn. A one one doctor. Ah! Mirage, how do these like creature? Two two. All three of them at first. So I'll take the one one and I'll block one of the one ones. Uh, and then so I'll take two more deep draw. Okay, I'll play this unclaimed territory, naming dinosaurs. All right, now we have colors. Three. Five, uh, Pantlaza. Is that good? Yeah. Uh, I'll discover four. The land. Uh, this is a Curious Altasaur. Vigilance reach whenever a dinosaur controlled deals combat damage to a player, draw a card. These will go to the bottom. Arrgh. Get down there. Okay. Um, one mana remaining. Can't really do anything with that. So we will go ahead to uh, combat. And uh, we will send this 2-3 in the air at... Sully, still nothing in the air untapped, right? Ah, send that 2-3 in the air at you. I'll send this Scion of Calamity... Uh, yeah, I'll send the Scion of Calamity at um, Crypt. Um, and it will have Myriad. So I'll have three token copies enter the battlefield. Attacking each other player, right? May create a token that's a copy of this creature that's tapped and attacking that player or planes. Oh wait, no, I can have it attack you. Another one attacking you. Each opponent. Oh, for each I opponent each other opponent. than defending player. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. So I have one attacking each of you. The original one is attacking crypt. Though. I have no response or no box. Uh, so if it deals combat damage to you, I'm going to destroy an artifact or enchantment on the Scion of Calamity. It's a five-five. Right? It's a five-five. Yeah. So your choice or our choice? Uh, uh, my choice. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I've got Fel Ring and Rhythm of the Wild. I've got a yeah, Fel I'll, I'll pop the Rhythm of the Wild. Is Fel Stone your only target? Yeah. Uh, your only valid target? Uh, yeah, so I'll have to pop the Fel Stone. Uh, it's not a May. Yeah. yeah, it's not a May. So I'll pop the Fel Stone, and then you chump block, Sully? Yeah, I chump block with the Gnome. Okay, cool. Uh, 
Uh, so it's going to be five damage to each crypt and mirage, and then it's going to be two damage in the air to Sully. On each of those, uh, I'm going to draw a card. Uh, so I'm going to draw three cards. I do have response as the target, though. Sure. We go white and the uh, green, I guess. We'll cast ring loaded saw blades. Uh, sure. Targeting the original sign of calamity. When it enters the battlefield, deals five damage to target tapped creature. Yeah, this is after damage, you're saying? Uh, four damage. I guess I do want the uh, Revenant of the Wild to go. That's up to you. I mean, you've you got the. the you already got the tapped dino that makes nah. things come untapped. I'll do it after yeah. damage. After damage. After damage. Ah, <laughs> <you're sad>. <laughs> <laughs> It's so it'll so also be after the damage on yours, so your your flower stone will still go, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, and it'll deal five damage to it? Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. All right, the tokens will exile combat. I'm going to still draw three cards, though. Yeah, yep. that's so mean. Cool. I will... Oh, so I don't I don't take five. Oh, no, it is. Is that Yeah, it's after, after damage, yeah. So you do I take won't five. forget this, Mirage. <laughs> <laughs> that's kind of funny. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. I do have a two five uh, with reach now, uh, Sully, just so you know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven cards in hand. I will. Do I have a one drop play now? No, I'll pass. Okay. I'll move my soul ring because it looks like a creature. I'll play land. I'll tap three. Play uh, Restoration of Iganjo. ETB. I'll get a basic. And I'll go to hand. I'll tap sure. one. I'll sack my ring blade traps for a mimic bat. And then I'll pass. Uh, great. And I will draw. I'll play another planes return. Uh, and then I will tap two red, green, white, and I don't enter in tap, but I will uh, discover four. Yeah, discover two. Uh, I will play Big Sally, play that. The uh, mana door. Stupid enters in. Yeah, that's also going to enter top. Yep. Right. yep. Uh, and then I've got um, Grover also gets plus two plus a dinosaur. Uh, I will pass the turn. <laughs> that is very good. Um, no response. Uh, really yeah, really it's gotta um, be. Packs. <laughs> no flying. Five gnomes are fucking wild. <laughs> so, a little silly, huh? So many. I know. Where both, gnomes coming? I know Vert and I both have. It's fine. We'll, we'll see if I find them. Red Nolo. Mirage there. I'm sorry, I took the five. My mic was muted. Yep. Hey, You're good. <laughs> On top. Keep draw this card. Sure, I'll play this Clifftop Retreat as land for turn. Uh, what do we want here? Do we want shenanigans or do we want shenanigans? Shenanigans, of course. Okay, I like the sounds of that. Uh, I'm gonna have six, seven. I will uh, tap out seven. Uh, right, that was seven, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, the seven. soul ring is two. Yeah. Yeah, seven. seven. All right, so it's seven. Uh, and I will play. Wait, do I have colors? Hang on. I actually have to make sure I, I didn't fuck up. And I do have colors. This I chose green. This is any mana. Okay, cool. Yeah, I have the colors. Seven. I will play Atali, Primal Conqueror. No response. <clears throat> any response? Okay. Uh, ETB. Um. Do you have the discover trigger first? Yeah, I'm trying to decide. I can. I can choose. Oh, it's uh, an ETB. Yeah, it's an ETB. So I, I can choose. Um, I'll do the discover trigger first. Um, I'll discover for seven. That will be immediate. The thundering spine back. Other dinosaurs uh, I control get plus one plus one, and I can pay six and create a three three dinosaur with trample. Uh, Atali trigger. Uh, we each exile uh, cards from the top of our library until we exile a non land card. All right. That's a land. Oh, uh, you're kidding. Unstable I get the bridge, 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 which is a board wipe. <laughs> I've got uh, Atali. You got an Atali. Sick. All right, cool. Uh, and you got Let's a see. what? Uh, Skull, clamp. Skull clamp? That is a good one. Uh, I, got, I got a board wipe, so I mean, you don't want to cast that. Cool. Uh, is it... How much of a board wipe is it? Uh, <laughs> choose a uh, creature to power to a last from each opponent, and they destroy the rest. Enters the battlefield if you cast it for each player. For each player. Choose. It's pretty one-sided. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't really help. Uh, it doesn't help anyone me. else besides, I think, me and maybe Sully. But even yeah, though, uh, it's kind of awkward. I don't, I don't think you want a Tali either. Uh, why would I not want a Tali? Uh, I can pay. Oh, I may cast any number of spells from among them. Yeah, Exile this way without paying your mana cost. Yeah. yeah. All right, so let me get the Skull Flame for sure. Uh, let me get my. So that's that's just a free Skull Flame, right? Let me get my infinite tokens here. What's the equip cost for Skull Clamp? One. 
here. All right, that's a skull clamp. I will cast the Itali as YOLO. I would've been so sick on my turn. Itali 2, electric boogaloo. It's a 6-6, six, six, right? Yeah, 6-6. Six, six. Have... I'm just leaving it right here. Since it's... And then I will cast my Earthshaker Dreadmaw um, for free. This command tower will remain exiled. Yeah. Um, and Earthshaker, Dreadmaw, ETB, I'm going to draw a card for each other dinosaur I control. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Holy fuck. I will have to discard down the hand size at one point this turn, but not before we go to combat. Um, are we in combat now? Yeah, I mean, I tapped out. I played a land for turn. I got fucking nothing else to do. That was wild. Um... So yeah, I'll go to combat. I will send this curious Altasaur uh, at uh, Mirage. You have no blockers up? Or wait, no uh, Crypt, do you have any blockers up? I've got one, and it's a 4-4. Four, four. All right, sure. So I'll send this 2-5 at Mirage. It has Vigilance and Reach. It's a 2-5. Or it's a 3-6, actually, because of uh, the Thundering Spine back. And I will send this 3-4 in the air at... Solid, do you have air blockers? Okay, so I'll send this 3-4 in the air at Crypt. Uh, and then... Uh, yeah, that'll be... That'll be it. Um, and then... Uh, I'll draw two cards off of the two dealing damage. Draw two. And then I will move to discard after that fucking bonkers turn. I yep. will discard a Myriad Landscape, a... I'll pitch this arc of Orzok, uh, 12 cards in hand. Yeah, you can go ahead while I'm discarding. I'll let you know if there's anything. On top. Calling Aegis. I'll, draw, I'll play, um, basic. Oh, and second chapter, um, I'll cast a Solemn Simulacrum. ETB, get a basic planes onto the... Yeah. I will... I discard it down. Uh, the only things of note, really, are Runic Armasaur. Uh, and bellowing Aegis Aegisaur, which they just like pump or draw me cards. Pump. Then I'll pay a white to try to some smacker. That'll die. Draw a card and death. I'll get a five drop. Do it. Blow it up. Like, will we survive? Earth uh, I'll get a Cataclysmic Gear Hulk. Uh, ETB, player choose an artifact creature, enchantment, and planeswalker they control and sack. Ah, I hate that. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Sack my creature and yeah. I think I'm gonna keep Panlaws there. What? I'll sack my mana dark. One of each. Choose one of each permanent type and sack the rest. Yeah. Okay. And Except for Lion. Yeah, I chose okay. my commander and I kept Soldier as well. Alright. Yeah, exactly gonna, the same. I'm gonna scoop up a tally under my Mimic Vat. Oh, okay. Which one? The ETB one. Uh, and then I'll pass. Uh, I'll meme. Because uh, it exiles, right? Yeah, it exiles it until I exile something else. Alright, I will untap. I'll play a Thriving Grove. Tap. I'm gonna choose the green and red. I will tap two. Uh, yeah, I do. Okay, I'll tap two, five, and I'll play Temple, Altrasaur. Um, three, four. If a source would deal damage to another dinosaur you control, prevent all but one. Uh, at Laza trigger. Uh, and I will discover toughness. I'll discover four. That was great. Yeah. Hold oh, my lands. Uh, That's I'll really play. Great. Uh, Progenitor's Icon enters the battlefield, choose a creature type. I will choose Dinosaur. Oh, no, uh, attach one. I don't <laughs> say. Uh, attach my mana, attach next spell, it cast is uh, as. Uh, and then, okay, so you've got a 6 7, you've got a Tali. Or no, that's Zach. That. Yeah. Um, I will pass, and I'll put the rest on the bottom in a random order. Going to play a 5, taking in Confluence. Oh, she doesn't have to attack, right? No. That's She's good. Gonna trigger. I'm gonna go to combat, swing my commander. Uvert, six gnomes. So many. <laughs> All six over at Uvert. Ah! Um, yeah, so I'm gonna take the seven commander for sure. And then I'll put Banalaza in front of one of them. Uh, and take, what, five more? Yep. Uh, I will add the. Uh, it's Ami. Uh, or, I mean, yeah, got it. Uh, no, 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 go on. What creatures do you have? I have a 4-4 four, four, and a 3-4. Three, four. The 3-4 three, allows me to prevent all damage on other creatures. Except for one. Except for one, so it takes one damage. I'm gonna create seven gnomes. I'll block 
two of them, one with Alistar, one with And them. your commander's a 8 9, so it is. 8 8. eight. On top, keep, draw this card. Um, play Moss Warp Bridge, enters top to ETB. I, uh, uh, what's it called? It's Hideaway 4. I'll yeah. top. I uh, will take this card. I uh, then will. Uh, fuck it. We came here to play dinosaurs, so here's some dinosaurs. He's doing the thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Here's a Verdant Suns Avatar. Uh, ETB, I'm gonna gain five life, uh, and uh, I'm gonna trigger Pentlaza. That's a good one to have. Is that good? Yep. ETB is good. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that resolves for me. Okay, and. Uh, Autopack Huntmaster. Uh, I will gain two. And then it's a dinosaur spell that costs one less to cast and target dinosaur gain. I can tap in. Target dinosaur gains haste until it itself does not have haste. I will pass the turn. I got nothing else yet. Pass. Uh, last chapter. Uh, the 3-4. I'll play tap one. Play. Good. And then I'll, I'll pay white. I'm going to sack my top for a two drop. I'm gonna get a Mycosynth Wellspring. That'll ETB get me a basic. And then I'll pass. No, I'm sorry, I'm playing the basic for turn. One tap. Bro. Play a Rogue Passage. Turn. Two. Green. Two. Two. I'll play Regal, play Demon. I will become. Uh, and then whenever I tap a land uh, while you're the Monarch, add an additional one man. Uh, ETB Trio Pilaza, I will discover five. Uh, yeah. Kinjali Sunwing, I will play that. Creatures going to control, enter the battlefield tap. I've seen sorry. that one before. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm going to tap to three. I'll also play Brass's Tunnel Grinder. When Brass and Tunnel Grinder enters the battlefield, discard any number of cards and draw that many cards from one. I'll discard one. It's a way to trainer prodigy. Um, then. Go to... Does that do anything else, that thing? Yeah, so at the beginning of your end step, if you descended this turn, put a boar counter on Brass Tunnel uh, Grinder. Then if there are three or more boar counters on it, remove those counters and transform it, and it becomes a land uh, that taps for red, and, or, uh, or not, and then when it taps, whenever I cast a permanent using mana produced by Tectalon, uh, discover X, where X is that spells of mana value. Nice, okay. Uh, let's move to combat. Mirage, do you have any block? Yeah, but 3-4. Uh, I'm, I, I'm gonna just go to M step. Uh, and M step, I will the 1 1 counter, uh, and I will draw with Marnar. Yes, draw with Marnar. Yep. Uh, and I will. Another double combat phase out of Sully here. Big spook. <coughs> I'm in tap. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> uh, let me see if I have a. Uh, response for that okay and then uh don't forget you get it oh okay great is it um tapped or untapped uh, it's tapped. tapped tapped and the and the uh the pterodactyl thing is exiled yeah. i'm gonna just bring in a tap five or if one or more creature tokens would be created under your control that many oh, four four white <laughs> <laughs> creature tokens <laughs> <laughs> oh no i think we see where this is going <laughs> oh this is like game no bueno so if you attack he makes like Nine four fours. Is that what that is? Ah. So I make I make eight four fours, but they're not tapped and attacking. Why are they not tapped and because attack? Because oh, Anim makes the gnomes tapped and attacking, but the vine oh. visitation is a replacement effect. So oh, it's, okay, so we're not dead, but we're just dead. fucked. Just lots, <laughs> lots of them. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. I hear you. I hear you. Wing Anim. Really spicy. All the gnome. Five of the gnomes. All ten of the gnomes at vert. Eight angels. Oh. I just want to see if I have it. At, least, put, at least have responses put, before blocks. I don't, oh, before okay. blocks. Okay. I don't have any. And then we can go to blockers after that. So I'm going to make a copy of the 6-6 uh, six, six Italian. What is it? ETB Italian? 7-7 uh, seven, seven Italian. Yes. Make a copy of the 7-7 seven, seven Italian, which will have the ETB trigger. And then it's exile until it hit an online for everyone. Oh, you got a Teferi? <laughs> 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 what the? Uh, yeah, just, that's funny as shit. I just missed something. What happened? So he, so I Mirage got... is playing my Itali from the Mimic Vat, uh, nice. yeah. and so he, you, so you have to exile off the top until you yeah. exile a non-land card. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, 
I just exile Thrashing Brontosaur, 3-4, A1, sack it, destroy target, artifact, or enchantment. I think you should take that. And then... awesome. Yes, good. that uh, does sound good. Um, and so... mine is the Progenitor's Icon that uh, that Crypt already has on his. I need to cast it to Teferi's last so I can use my mana. Yeah. But I can cast before that the... the... Is that a mana rock? That's the same one that Crypt had, right? Oh. Yeah, this is a mana yeah. rock. Yeah. Okay. So... It's a mana rock and it lets you play creatures of the chosen type at flash speed. If you uh, tap it, but then you lose the mana for it uh, on that yeah. turn, you know. I'll cast that. Uh, well, I guess first I'll cast my Might Stone and Weak Stone. I'll draw two cards. And then I'll cast the Mana Rock that you have there, Albert. I'll choose. Sure. <laughs> and then the Thrashing Brontodon. Um, then I'll and cast. It's, like, it's pay one. What color? Is it green? Pay one. It just, it's one colorless and then sack it. Okay. Yeah, and then I'll cast the Teferi's Protection, holding priority to try to destroy the Divine Visitation. You, it's you. You can sack it. Not, yeah, uh, yeah. It's a, I am, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah, yeah, one. He's saying he's, he's got saying it. Saying he's uh, cast it. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's good. Got it. Got it. I love it okay. And then the Teferi's Protection. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing's done. Your fate. All right. So blocks. Uh, I'm gonna put one in front of each of the ten, or one blocker in front of each. Uh, the tokens the one ones that are coming at me so yeah and i'll take seven you didn't swing anything my way did you Not yet. <laughs> did i take did i start taking damage fuck or eight fuck what was i at before that your angel i was at 32 what's up i was asking if your angels tokens attack next combat they cannot okay they don't have haste i'm good i i, I took the seven i have a five five a four four and this is not a dinosaur but it's a one two on my known tokens, I'll I'll block three and take six. You'll take the monarchy here, Sully. Um, yeah, you'll take one. Uh, does your commander have trample? No, but they do have both. They both have first. Oh, they both have first strike. Um, uh, I'm gonna. Uh, <laughs> it's 15. Think you keep that one? No. Fifteen's a lot. Uh, <laughs> well, if you discover like enough, you'll gain that back. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do nothing. I'm gonna take 15. Oh my God. Wait, how much commander okay. damage? 10 commander. Yeah, and I'll break. be at 17. That's fine. Spooky. <laughs> yeah. <For sure. laughs> uh, I'll go to 10. Okay. That's it. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I can't help but feel like I kind of got robbed that turn. <laughs> A little bit. <laughs> that was kind of nuts. Hey, though. that's your fault though. I would never hit that if you didn't have it. Very true. I only, I guess I only have myself. <laughs> Okay. I'm gonna. You have 32. Yeah, I'm at 32. Okay. I'll play a Rogue's Passage as long for a turn. Don't mind that. That, that doesn't do anything. Um, I, I will say, get out of here. if there's Look. any way you can get me a treasure or a zero mana artifact, I, I could wipe the board. I I will also <laughs> politic a little bit here. If you just get me to my next turn, I can. I kind of want to do something more fun. Again, I came here to play dinosaurs. True. <laughs> so, I'm also playing dinosaurs. We're going to play dinosaurs. Play dinosaurs. dinosaurs. Hey, I'm playing dinosaurs too. I got a talent. Oh, oh <laughs> true. I'm you do not playing dinosaurs. <laughs> it's big enough to be part of the club. So 8, 7, or 10, 11, jeez. 12, uh, 11. 1, 2, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah. Oh, look at this hideaway card. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Uh, let's go. Uh, Come on, you, let me get to my turn. Let's go. I'm gonna tap one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm gonna use eight of that, floating a floating a green actually. Uh, is a comma. There you go. That's a good one. ETB. Uh, I'm gonna gain nine. I'm gonna untap all my lands. So everything but the soul ring. And again, I'm floating a green. Um. Where's my, this is that green mana. Uh, and then I'm gonna trigger, trigger penalizer. Yeah, discover nine. Okay, that's a five, five. Um, this is a wrathful raptors. Uh, whenever a dinosaur I control is dealt damage to any target, uh, is dealt damage, I can deal that much damage to any target that isn't a dinosaur. Uh -huh. um, yeah. yeah I'm gonna use that green. I'm gonna tap the Moss Rip Bridge. I'm gonna cast Xenagos oh. for oh, look. the hideaway. So it is a green. 
Uh, it is a creature. Yeah, you're right. Right? Is it? Uh, it is a creature. Red and green. You you have more than seven. Six. Eight. Yeah, eight. Yes, sir. You are right. Hmm. Let me uh. Let me think about how I want to do this. I'm gonna be doing some major wombat combat over here. Uh, did you gain your life? Uh oh, off this guy I did not, and off okay. this guy I did not. So another ten. Thank you. Uh, it kind of paid off. Yeah. Um. All right. So I'm gonna tap this. I'm gonna have the wrathful raptors gain haste off of this. Um. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's the right choice. I'm gonna move to combat. All right, uh, I am going to have to do some math here. You're Teferi, right, Mirage? Yeah. Uh, cause, uh... It's a 10, 10 with Trample? Hang on a second. It's not a, uh, what, this guy is not a 10, 10. This guy, I'm giving haste off of Raptors. Oh, uh, I see, okay. Uh, why is my calculator not coming up? I don't care. Math is for blockers, right? True. <laughs> I'm gonna send, uh... Okay, I'm moving to combat. Uh, beginning of combat, I'm going to have Zakama be the target of Xenagos. So Zakama is going to be an 18 18 with haste. Um, yeah. Uh, haste trample and vigilance. I'm going to send Zakama at uh, Sully. I'm going to send this Wrathful Raptors and the Verdant Sun's avatar at Crypt. I'm going to send Pantlaza at Sully, uh, uh, four blockers. I'm going to, uh, one, two, three, four. I'm gonna have a chrome as well. So, these two are going at Sully, these two are going at Crypt. Yeah. And I'm casting a chrome as well on the stack. And you get, uh, the flying vision of the devil striker. Yep, and pro colors. Well, that's. Sorry? That's what, two five fives? That's yeah, so these are. This 20. is gonna be 20 damage. Yeah, uh, I can't. No, I cannot. Buy him out. Okay, I think no. I can. Pro colors, and they're all in the air. Oh, it's pro color. So you can block the gnomes. Or are the gnomes colored? Yeah, but they're not in the air. Oh, but the, the angels are colored. <laughs> I also. That was the next <laughs> card. Wait, was that the next <laughs> card? You just flipped it? Oh, okay. So I also had Zakama in my hand, so my plan was yeah, yeah. Zakama. That's pretty neat. Uh. I would have raging uh, sword tooth to kill all the one one, and then I would have just kept tapping the comma. I would have I had enough. A, I have a fall. So we're good on that. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm good. Okay, uh, so I'm gonna gain twenty. I'm gonna gain thirty. What is this? Uh, twenty, thirty six. Uh, thirty six and twenty is fifty. Uh, fifty six, and then uh, eight. Uh, Fifty six and eight is sixty. This is why I added rampage in front. I need a top deck. <laughs> uh, these are tapped because I did it after attackers. Zakama is not tapped because he has vigil. Okay. Um, I gain. What did I just say? Sixty four. Sixty four and twenty nine is uh eighty. It's ninety three. <laughs> uh, sorry. Uh, second main. Uh, nothing. Pass the turn. <laughs> oh, this top deck. It's gotta be, it's gotta be the card. So. You also have, um, or you have Monarch. Oh, I have the Monarch, so I'll draw some and stuff, whatever. And this is not the card, so I think, unless you have like a board wipe from Itali, I think that's the only way I can do anything. So, uh, you could hit a board wipe from Itali. I'll tap three. I'll activate my Mimic Bat again, Itali. Sure. I will While hit a couple you doing your turn. Uh, GG's, I have to run. run. All right. Yeah, I, hit, I hit a couple of it. Yeah, that's not gonna help. Uh, I'm passing. I don't have anything. I'm just waiting for it. Uh, do you cast a cultivate? Do you care? Uh, I don't really care. I don't have anything. <laughs> okay. I'll just scoop, I guess, to make it faster. Yeah, I'll just draw. I have a Zapalta off the top. It doesn't really matter. Yeah. Jeez. Jeez. Yeah, that was a nutty turn. Yeah, Dinos. Dude, I love this deck. Holy shit. It's so much <laughs> fun. I honestly, I'm kind of getting worried about it because, so, I feel like dinosaurs, they get a lot of hate, or, like, hate, it's the stronger. Like, uh, when people play Gishath, mm -hmm. it's like, must kill Gishath immediately. Like, hits the board, you must deal with it, right? Yeah. But, like, I feel like Pantlaza, it's like, same energy, you know, yeah. it's it's not necessarily the same energy. I think people are more okay with leaving it around um, for, like, 
more than you know a turn not gonna lie know? i feel like it's the same as a new color cell drowsy soul to rock i think it's like this yeah. so similar it's like cascade on your big boys and it's just gonna lead to like hectic board states uh, yeah. Really? Okay. I mean, that's, that's like what that. I think. I think it's stupid good. I, I just feel well, like I... Thing. It's 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 crazy value. You play big dinos, you just yeah. play bigger dinos right after. Anything that can cascade for like... Oh, yeah. Sure. No, I mean, I, I agree. I just feel like from playing it a couple times, I feel like people have been leaving it around way more than I've seen people deal with Gishath. Like, I don't have a Gishath, but like... I every time I've played against a Gishat deck, it's like as soon as it hits the board, it's like path immediately. Like yeah, it doesn't even get the 